Hey everybody, do you like Jihad? Do you like Holy Wars? Do you like Crusades? Because boy do we got one for you! You can kind of see barely the glowing outlines of tons of country fighting countries fighting us since the Pope declared a Holy War on us a couple episodes ago. Or maybe it was the last episode, I forget. And all these guys are fighting us. Kings and a lot of dukes. Maybe some counts, I don't know. I can't count them all! <laughs> right now we're in the middle of a big battle right here, which is mostly our retinue and a few vassal troops. We are defending a hill, we are on the bottom here, against an inferior number of attackers. Ooh, we have a new error! If your character dies, you'll now play as Radigan Flashnov. We're going to change that name. What would be a good name? We are going to call him... Flynn. In like Flynn. Oh, we're about to crush that flank right there. I want to see that big time. Uh, you can also see right here that the Holy Roman Empire is trying to siege this area. Once again, this war is a holy war for Germany. This lined area is Germany. They want the tanned part of Germany that we currently occupy. Here you can see some soldiers of the Teutonic Order. That was once a 10,000-man army. But due to attrition, lots of them have died marching west. We have some armies here that are going to assault here and here. These are little dudes who are actually relative of ours, relatives of ours distantly who are helping the enemy. Here the enemy is sieging our castle. They're probably going to win that siege, but they are suffering from attrition, which is good. Oh, and apparently there's an army up there doing the same thing. Oh, they're from, like, way up here. We're fighting Scotland, Sweden, lots of dukes, parts of France, part of Italy. But more importantly, right now, in the short term, we're just focusing on this battle. We broke their left flank. Our right flank crushed them. And their left. We're crushing their center now. Ooh, we got another battle going on right here. While we're at it, why don't we send you up through here as reinforcements? Just in case, we'll send you through as reinforcements. And we routed that army up there. That's good news. Victory! We have too many guys here. I want you to stay here. One retinue unit, you go here. Other retinue unit, you march around this way. Uh, we've got another battle going on right there. We're going to send in more reinforcements. We've also got a battle going on here. Let's check this one. Fortunately, we crossed a river, which was bad for us, but we are winning because we've got good troops. We've got reinforcements on the way. We're winning this battle right here, too. Oh, we broke their flank. Hell yeah. And we got some reinforcements in. We got 47% war score. Oh, we got another battle going on. Our retinue ran into some of their dudes. Victory! All right, that was the... Oh, another victory. That was the win right there. We might leave these guys here And what is this? Bamberg? Wham, bam, bam, your man, Bamberg. What are you talking about, honey? Sex talk, you wouldn't understand. Yes, I would, I'm lusty. Let's make more babies. Uh, we've had six kids now. Unfortunately, the eldest one passed away, and he was the best one. None of these other kids have any of the really good stats of the one that died, unfortunately. As we get these troops coming along, Ooh, we can see that Teutonic Order right behind us, trying to catch up. Some more victories. Urberhard Carlene! Ooh, we captured a Carlene? Was captured in battle and is now my prisoner. I don't know if the Carlenes are very powerful anymore, Walter Carlene, but the Carlenes used to be in charge of everything. Are you a Carlene? Oh, he is! The Emperor is the Carlene! So we caught relatives of the Emperor of the Holy Roman Empire. Are Carlenes still in charge of France? No. Well, in fact, I could have just gone to the Dynasty view. And you can kind of see Carlene's right there. So they're still a powerful family, even if they're not as powerful as they used to be. Alright, we won a bunch of battles. we got so many troops coming through here. Uh, we could probably move you into here. Probably move you into there. Move you into there. Trying to get everything kind of figured out a second. Want to make sure we move these troops up and in the right order. 
Oh, look at them trying to attack us. Our retinue is going to kick the crap out of them. 50% war score in our favor. We have yet to lose any territory. We might lose some soon. We won another battle. We captured another Carling Ferdinand. Yes, let's catch all of their family. Uh, we are definitely, unfortunately, suffering from some attrition. Victory! Alright, we got 8,000 guys here. We're going to have 5,000 move into there. They're going to retreat. Uh, what do we got right here? 2,000 and 3,000. We're going to move the 3,000 right here. Because we're watching that 10,000 man army. Right, 52% war score. Another victory! We're winning battles left and right at the moment. My prisoner, Ferdinand Carlin, is a giant bitch face who's complaining about being prison. Go to the oubliette, bitch face. Hope you die in there. Oh no! Our concubine, Desi Lava, has contracted consumption. Is she pregnant? And she's pregnant with our kid! At least pop that kid out before you die, girl. That's the kind of sweet romantic talk that Emperor Flash is known for. That's what every woman wants to hear. Pop that baby out before you die. Okay, the Teutonic Order, they are one of their armies is sieging. That's their banner right through the cross. When they're mad, are you like, are you cross with me? <laughs> Stupid. So we're about to finish sieging this place. That'll be a couple more weeks. Good, good, good. Start putting the pressure on these Crusaders. They are going to take this soon, or occupy it, but that's not a big deal, as that's not one of their war goals. It will help them. What they really need is stuff in here, this German-type area. Alright, so we're fighting a battle there and winning. Why don't we merge y'all? We'll move you into here. We'll move you into Nassau. It's interesting that 10,000 man, it's 12,000 man army has yet to come out to fight. What they are doing though is they're sieging the castle though, because they're like, we desperately need that war score. Let them feed their, feed their people the meat grinder. Yeah, our war score went down a lot, but we can deal with it. Steward High Chief Eilkin Powder had come up with an idea for removing a thieves guild in provinces. Paid them to move elsewhere. Um... The Thieves Guild will be moved, removed from Thrake. Okay, Thrake is one of our territories right next to Constantinople. Um, here's Constantinople. The former Byzantine headquarters. Here's Thrake. The Thieves Guild costs us 25% on castle, city, and temple taxes. Um, yeah, you know what? Pay those guys off. Get rid of the criminals. We need that tax revenue. Well, apparently they are attacking us here, the Knights Templar. Victory! Alright, we're going to merge these armies, and we're going to just go assault. They want to go spend all their guys, the lives of so many of their guys attacking our place. Go ahead, let them attack, and then we're going to hit them with our armies. I don't know where we had to defeat. In fact, I don't really even give a fuck right now. Uh, we have our own sieges going on. Alright, this battle will be on like Donkey Kong very soon. These guys should both show up at the same time, June 25th. And we already have them outnumbered and we're waiting for these guys to show up. Good deal. And there's no big terrain bonuses. You can see we're on the top. We don't have a proper leader on these flanks, unfortunately. Hopefully these guys are bringing some proper leaders. They do have someone in their army. Yeah, there we go. Properly outnumbered, proper leaders. We're on top. We outnumber them two to one, and we have even more reinforcements on the way. Hopefully, this is a big battle that will start to turn the. Well, I don't say. I was going to say turn the tide of the war, but the tide of the war is already in our favor. Uh, why don't we move this army up into Glottenbotten land? 
as we are busy besieging lots of their territory. A daughter was born to Emperor Flash, the sword of Erlik Khan, and Desi Lava named Stoy Yanka. How about Stoy Va Yanka? <laughs> I don't think that's quite right. That's Stow. Stow Yavajanka. Yeah, we'll say that. When she's taking it out, don't be like your mom and a slut. Stow Yavajanka. Classy names for classy kids. Oh, and we have crushed the uh, Holy Roman Emperor's army. What's up now, Pope Butthead? Uh, we are going to merge these and split them in half. We're going to split this army in half again. One half is going to go there to chase them down. The other half is going to go here. And the 11,000 that remain are going to assault us as soon as we can to retake the temple. And then we're going to assault the castle as soon as we can. Get rid of their 51 troops to retake it. We're going to get that war score right back up in our favor. And we have... and Oops, there's some guys that got there somehow. Victory! And that 11,000 army, we're going to split that further again. 5,000 of which are going to go reinforce here. In this battle, the other six or five thousand are going to reinforce the other battle. Look at that, we're back up to 54% war score. We need some more guys in there, apparently. I don't know how many of these guys we got to defeat to win this thing. Certainly killing a ton of enemy troops. How's this battle going? Victory! All right, you go up and attack here. We're gonna send you up this way. We're just gonna meet these idiots as they come off the boat. Come on, crush that left flank of theirs. Left flank crushed, we're gonna start flanking their center. What's up now, holy warriors? Uh, defeat, where? Oh, it's a siege way in the middle of the country. Not too worried about that. Technically, these guys could go up there and deal with it, but we're too busy sieging these areas from them. Uh, victory! We will bring you down here. We'll bring you there, and then why don't we bring... We're going to split this army. So we can get enough guys in there to start sieging there properly. Did I do the right army? Just in case, we're going to send two armies there. Better to have and not need. Oh, we're about to route that army up there, too. Victory! Mayor T Tad of Renfrews. Sure, everybody knows him. He's our prisoner now. <laughs> Popular guy, from what I hear. Oh, we're going to win another battle right here, it looks like. I wonder if we should siege the uh, capital of the Holy Roman Empire. Probably doesn't really matter at this point. Victory! Yep, we control all of Germany. That really hurts the more score-wise. Look at all these victories. They're coming fast and furious, and we even have it on the slowest game speed right now. Oh, what's this? Oh, Teutonic Knights in the area? That's not good. Uh, we will move you there. We got a defender retinue. I don't know how good these guys are. We'll send them in. You'll be there on the 12th of October. So our army's just has got to hold out for like 12 days. These guys are mostly light cavalry and special units. That must have been the big army that was coming from the east. My prisoner is complaining about the prison. Oh, you don't like it? You don't like the fact that we feed you bread? And that you try to murder people? Go to the Oubliette and die. You're a jerk. Learn to be grateful for the good things you have, like not being dead. Because we can totally make you dead. It's the thing we do. 
Ah, uh, we got some reinforcements in there. We broke through the center. We got more reinforcements in there. What's up now, Teutonic Knights? We lost some trade posts in the middle of nowhere. No, we're no one cares. Not even the people at the trade post. Oh, we broke both their center and their right. Their left is about to get crushed now. They're trying to send more reinforcements in. Sorry, bro. Uh, we'll send an army after them. Uh, why don't we send you down here? We'll move all these troops down a bit. Can I... <laughs> Sorry, I get a little frustrated. I should have just paused it. We get the messages so fast. We should win this over here. In fact, why don't we send an army over there to siege? Because I believe this is our retinue over here. Yeah, we already crushed their flank. We won the Battle of Worms, aptly named, because everybody's going to be eaten by worms afterwards. What's up now, Holy Warriors? Oh, and we did siege a place, apparently. Defeat? Where the hell is... Oh, oh right down there. Well, that's probably easy for them to take. They're going to run out of guys eventually. Yeah, come on. Come attack my dudes here. You're going to get your ass kicked in. That's how we do it, yo. You know what else I'm going to do? Let's see if the Holy Warriors... No, the Holy Warriors are not available. Because some dipshit here way in the east is using them. Even though we're fighting in an honest-to-God crusade and we could use them. We are going to use some money to improve some of our land, though. Nicopolis, why don't we build you... Uh, barracks, so we can get some more heavy infantry. Oh, excuse me. Sorry about that. I got too excited. Uh, we will send one of the armies after them. How are our other sieges going? Pretty good. How many guys do we need here? 2,600. We'll leave the 2,700 army there. Another victory. Siege of Mecklenburg. What? I'm confused. How did we win there? We don't own it. My prisoner of Baron's bitches a lot is going to the Oubliette. For bitching. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's chase these guys down. Once auto save is done, we won the siege of Babenberg. That's where the city of babies is, I think. You go in there and just poop everywhere, and they're like, "Wah, give me your titties." That's where I live too. Our war score has gone down some due to sieges, I guess. Elsewhere, I thought our war score would be doing better considering everything. How many troops does the Holy Roman Emperor have 6,000? Damn. What the fuck are these? Oh, they've got some assholes way up in the North Country where we don't have anybody. I guess that's going to happen when you're fighting so many people. Bring it! Y'all going to bring it? Because you're going to get your ass kicked, Teutonic Order. You think y'all just shit? You are shitty. Oh, these guys forgot to come to the war. Uh, we'll move him oh, right here into French territory. Because we still got enough guys here to cover each other if need be. Hopefully we'll start taking a bunch of territories or occupying a bunch of territories really soon. Alright, here comes another battle. Already we broke their flank. Why would you want to join the Teutonic Order? Were you guys watching Assassin's Creed and you thought it was cool? Because I'll tell you what, friend... The original Assassin's Creed is not cool. It is not cool. Uh, whoa, 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 what is this? 
King Denise of Magyar has inherited the Kingdom of Magyar and other titles from King Gazil the Great. Okay, I got worried. I thought he inherited another kingdom. Like it was a king inheriting another kingdom, so he'd have two. It's just one king getting the same king. Uh, you know what I mean. Uh, the King of Magyar gave it to the new King of Magyar. I was afraid, like, the King of Lithuania was going to get Lithuania and Magyar. We don't want that kind of stuff to happen. All right, where are you going, bro? Even if we have to, even if we, uh, even if we have to attack across the river, we're gonna try and hit these bastards. Victory at Leningen. Well, I hate to do it, everybody, but I think that's the end of this episode. I want to end this damn war. I feel like we deserve more war score for how many lives we have killed. But we are definitely... Oh, where are we hurting? It's because of these areas in the east that we've lost control of. That has hurt us a lot more than I thought. Well, there's not a hell of a lot we can do about it right now. Because our that's one of the drawbacks of how big our empire is. Wait, where's this guy going? Can we block him off? Usually they stop. Alright, we will be there on March 21st. They might be able to get out faster because they seem to have faster guys. We're going to try and engage them, but that'll be in the next episode. If we can destroy that army of the uh, Teutonic Order, we might be able to reclaim this. Ooh, and they have an army there dying of attrition. They have 6,000 some guys. But they got the attrition icon. I'll see you all next time where hopefully we'll make some more progress against these Catholics, man. Pain in the butt. Oh, wait, were we looking at this battle? So much. Uh, I'll see you next time.